Big meeting na the next room, so no vex if I miss you call. Na money talk, I be talk so. Oh, Emerson Bakari is a musician and an activist on a mission. Finally back in his home country of Sierra Leone after a four year stay in Nigeria, he's no stranger to controversy. His music has made him a target of both ruling and opposition party supporters. We've been crying for 59 years. <laughs> we deserve better. Whatever is happening between the political parties, it's not our concern. There are fights. It's not our concern. All we are asking for is a better Sierra Leone. We are asking whatever it takes for them to sit on that round table, talk the politics, talk, talk and understand themselves for the better, better, betterment of all Sierra Leoneans. His latest album, Nine Lives, was released in August and tackles issues of corruption, tribalism and partisanship. Bukhari's lyrics have not shied away from the issues and he's even been sent death threats because of them. In one track called Coconut or Coconut Head, Bakari sings, regardless of who's in power, there'll be no change because they know we've made a strong decision to be blindly partisan. It's, it's heart-surrendering for me. You know, this is the 21st century. For God's sake, we're not asking for the world. We're just asking for basic, basic amenities like pipe bond water. His Afrobeat message is one that says, although power may shift hands, nothing changes for the poor in Sierra Leone as long as corrupt and incompetent officials continue to be elected. <laughs>